All right, gamers, we're back. We're back in action. Welcome aboard. Can you tell it's the same filming session as the last video? Oh my god. I'm saying, let's do it. Okay? I'm saying, let's do it. Let's grab Norway here. We outnumber them. I think we can we can win the naval battle on the high seas. Let's, let's fucking do it, okay? Like, Castile we can't get for three years anyway. Let's do it, man. Just have to be smart about where we where we push here. Oh, legitimacy. Give it. Give me legitimacy. <laughs> Please and thank you. Look at Longberg, dude. I hate what I'm doing right now. Like, fuck my diplo slots. Oh, hello. Ah, uh, yes, I forgot about East Frisia. Go clap that real quick. Now, these islands out here are not going to do much for me. I'm thinking it might be best to just try to land here. So, actually, we'll, we'll island hop a little bit. We'll just go for Akershus, I guess. Right? I mean, I don't know. Let's go down to three speed, though. What am I doing? Let's get him across to Bergen Hus. Hopefully no bad boys there. Oh. Norwegian fleet. Oh, get clapped. Oh, captured two ships. Two transport ships, too. That's big. That's pretty big for me. Now, will I be able to get... Yeah, 82% war score. I can steal Norway. Whew. Now, the time is running out on the Castile thing. Yeah. But if I did that, I might be able to get a bunch of allies to assist. Going for the power plays today, boys. I got an Aragon and Naples. Okay. 1480 or 1493, we can do that one. Oh, shit. Oh, we got the, the French little boys showing up to help. Man, hell yeah. Fucking hell yeah. Oh, two more ships captured? Lights. Okay, honestly, I don't need to siege that. I just need to make sure that it can't create more men. Let's get the, the armies together. They're coming to fight me there.
which they will win. I need to get this army out. All right, we got Borbonais, slow it down. Excellent. Again, just helping helping out the Diplo slots there. Minus one. Oh, because I have all those fucking... Yeah, I have all this. I need to get rid of that. I don't need it anymore. I got my guys through. There, that helps. Um, did not miss any. Okay, cool. Okay, so this that four thousand men's dead. They are roasted. Dude, you gotta get off the ship, dude. Okay, quick. They've got to get under the ships. Are they going to get caught? No. Get in the ships. No. <laughs> F. F's in chat, boys. Okay, they actually need some healing. So let's get them in here. We'll pull them out at the month tick. Let's try to get a little bit more health on these guys. Because these, these fleets, they have three heavies. Like, it's a lot of ships, but they have no heavies. Get in there. Catch them. Oh! Trying to keep tabs on both. Two captured ships, dude. Brilliant. Your navy is my navy. 1492, so Castile is almost in our grasp. Let's check on him again. Still no air. That's more important than Norway. Like, no question. Three captured ships. More barks. Beautiful. Let's get on subjects again. Desmond almost likes us. Now the thing is, we're going to have to push into Sjæland. Oh, sick. What the hell? Oh, Alan Jones helping us out. Cool, dude. Alan Soden. So I won't peace out until they are sieged. They want to die all the way.
1492, Columbus sailed the ocean blue. Oh my god. May 1493, guys. One year. One year away. Do that. Burgundy no longer a great power. And Portugal won't defend them either. Oh god! What does the enemy naval strength look like? So have a lot of ships and a lot of them are galleys. They have more ships than we do and a lot of them are galleys. So in there, they're very, very powerful. Let's go try to clap this fleet. I don't have a... I don't have an admiral. No heavies, it's just a bunch of transports. One, but no ships. Um, we need legitimacy up anyway, I guess. I don't know how I'm going to get it up, but that's what we need. May 1493 for Castile, you guys. I probably should have just waited on that. But here we are. We're gaming. Okay, we got colding. Now the next step, I'm not sure. Our war score is still ticking up. to catch this these 10 ships nice 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 captured a ship it's like a transport i'm up to 24 transports which is pretty neat if you ask me what is my diplo per month three? Oh my god man May 1493. May 1493, dude. This run becomes fucking epic if we can get Castile. But, and if it means we have to give up on Norway, then it means we have to give up on Norway. You know, like... This is going to be a slog to get that much war score. And I don't think we can win this naval battle. 39. They have 60 ships total. And a lot of them are galleys. So in there, in here, they're much stronger. So yeah, I don't know about it. Alright, what do we got here? land in Akershus. It's January 93. Oh. oh, it's a much better general. Oh, God. It's close. And I have a crossing penalty. Great. That's a dub, boys. Um... Oh, I need the tech. Yeah, Denmark's tech 8. February 93, boys. Oh. 
I'm gonna... I'm gonna push in here. Oh, they bitched out. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Here we go. I have to peace out Denmark first. Um, We'll just grab that and money. Because AE has to be down for this Castile Gambit. Oh my god. If he gets a if he gets a an error right now, I swear to god. Oh my god. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go! Here we go, boys. The big pog. In the meantime, let us fabricate on Denmark uh, more so that we can try to do that thing again. Because the truce here should only be five years. 1500, okay. So we might have another chance to swipe Norway, maybe, but it's nothing compared to this Castile PU. We're out of mans, but that should be fine. They are tech 7, the same as us. We need to get to tech 8, though. Burgundy is in a war. I might be able to call them in. Oh, what are you doing? Fuck, they just died. Again, we're rushing that tech idea. Minus two for terrain, damn. Big battle here. Big naval battle. Nice. We have 13 ships in port there. We got a ship. All right, let's get you into port here. You need to rest. Oh, God. Um, we'll lose the Ducats. I think I picked up a heavy. I think I captured a heavy there. Let's increase tax modifier. That's what we really need. Detach siege. Get back. Austria's defender of the Catholic faith. Oh, God. Let's get you in the board. I bet you'll heal, fa heal faster at home. 
This should be pretty open and shut here. I can't call in anyone, unfortunately. But we've, I mean, we've won all the big battles. Pause, gain influence. <laughs> Fucking make it harder for me. Are you serious? That's great. That's so great. He just put 18,000 of his men in Desmond. That's so good for me. Oh my god. Like, that saves me... That's 18,000 men I don't have to fight. They're just attritioning away up there. Oh my goodness. That is so great. That is so great. YouTube, YouTube people. I don't think you understand. Or, actually, you probably do understand because you know this game better than I do. <laughs> but that is so great. Oh my goodness. thinking about my missions now here what do we got here so i gotta subjugate oh i gotta reconquer the english stuff on the mainland before i can get down to old alliance okay these guys are almost a full fighting strength and we can pull them out we can sortie them uh, now let's just sortie. Let's go. Oh, we got Burgos. Oh, no. Uh, oh, no, yeah, actually. That's great. Just send back the ships to be repaired. Fuck him up. Oh, yeah. There's his heavies, too. So I've located his heavy ship fleet. I can't believe he has... He has 23,000! He has 23,000 men. He has 23 regiments up there. That's like the majority of his army. Oh my gosh. We got it, boys. AI dumb. Um, grab the prestige because our legitimacy is still pretty pretty poorly low. It's still pretty bad Still hasn't even finished sieging that oh I don't want to lose any ships. I want to continue to steal them from my enemies.
Oh, sweet. How many ships is this? 13 transports? So we'll pick them off right here. As soon as that's done sieging. Like, come on. Too fucking easy. AI dumb, man. Like, it, it feels bad how easy this was. I got three ships. Three more transports, dude. Oh, dude. Pick them off again. How many this time? How many do we get this time? Three more, baby! And three more? I've got a second fleet here, dude. Gosh. Then we can start beating up Portugal. I mean, if, if there's time, I want to go back in on Denmark, though. That is, grabbing Norway would be a really good opportunity. But this is way bigger. I mean, getting Castile, getting a, another great power under your belt, like, come on. Come on, man. They are attritioning here. Okay. Oh, and I'm out of sailors. Can't grab that 16k, baby. Ooh, ooh, I need the reinforcements, actually. Morale is low. Morale is low. What are you doing, Alvern? Got Toledo. Need 84%. What's my king? He's my king is 36. He's a youngin. Still won't do it, huh? Got him. Boom. Wrecked him? I hardly know him. Alright, we got the Union. Got a coalition, but it doesn't matter. Got the Union. Got 92 ducats. We formed a personal union with Castile and Navarra. Now we have to get their Liberty Desire down quickly. Okay. So what we learned um, playing off or on the multiplayer game is if you just develop their provinces.
the Spanish. It gets you minus five liberty desire for doing it once. Like, that is insane. It, it feels broken. They're 55. It's that fucking easy. Now I do need to get their relations up with me fast. Like, who's going to mess with me now? Like, we got Castile. Like, we could go in on Portugal and England now. Um, the truce with Denmark ends in a while, a long time. Got a while to wait on that. Yeah, so that's that's going to be a long time coming. Um, we're close to here, close to Alan Schoen. Yeah, we just got to improve relations. Thirty three transports, that's sick. Oh, my. I'm annoyed that I lost Milan. I'm annoyed I'm not getting Burgundy, but grabbing Castile like that is pretty great. That's some top tier. It's an omen. Oh, they got Chartres. That's no good. Come on now, boys. Talk to me like that, boys. Wrecked them. They went golden age already, damn it. Come on, Castile. <laughs> 22,000 men in Ireland, you guys. Absurd. Such So silly. So silly. Okay, my fleet maintenance is... Oh, six extra. The economy is not good. It's not looking too hot right now. Gain legitimacy. Awesome. Oh, the reformation happened. So that means mean time to happen is 10 years until I can no longer do the little steel Norway thing. Which really wouldn't be a big deal. It was just kind of a like, wouldn't that be fun? Wouldn't that be funny? <laughs> Not a big deal, but um, definitely want to keep an eye on that. Because if the Age of Reformation... If we can get Norway before the Age of Reformation, then that'd be that'd be pretty nice. Pretty nice. All right, we're waiting again, so I'm gonna pop it up a little bit. Oh, we can get Alenson. Start annexing them. All about getting our diplo slots back. Three percent. Great. So that'll be done very quickly. We could revoke this, but not yet. The liberty desire effect is nice. Um, let's grab the professionalism. 
put the forts down. Give a general. Get practicing, boys. And do we need to... 20%? No, we're just barely good if we stop paying for that. Who's going to break? Aragon is going to break. Why is Aragon going to break? Because I'm allied to Burgundy and Naples, both of which they do not like. Huh? Love me, gamer. Alright, they're close, but we just have to get them to liking us. It's actually falling as our as our manpower increases and the opinion increases. So I think we're good there. But I just had to dev their provinces and their liberty desires low and now just have to get this up. It's like it's too easy. It's too easy. So here's where we stand in 1497. Not fucking bad. Not fucking bad. Probably not going to get Burgundy. It's fine. I'm salty, but it's fine. But it's fine. But I'm salty, but it's fine. Now that we have Castile, we will be able to vassalize Portugal very easily we'll get a relations bump with castile if we're at war as i i believe so if we start like a little war here with like tier canal yeah that that's a micro war So let's do that. Just to make sure, you know. We should be fine with Castile, but I just want to really make sure. So let's do that. Yeah, that got us like 25 points for free. Oh, give me that legitimacy. Oh, yes. Game on, gamer. The Duke died. So that's it. That's like confirmed no event, right? The Duke just died. Which again, that sucks, you know? That sucks, but what can you do? One of those RNG events. Don't think I'm going <clears throat> to be able to beat that allied fleet, but. Ooh, that's bad. Down to one stab. Lost an advisor. How are we looking here? It's pretty low across the board. I need to get my legitimacy up. Check around. Let's look at Aragon getting close to potential. Denmark will have a peace treaty with soon, so we can try to do that again. 
But yeah, I think I think the Burgundy cause is lost. Oh, we got Norfolk. Sweet. Give me your ships. Castile's at minus six. So at the year tick. Oh man, that's nerve wracking. That is nerve wracking. So I should be fine at the year tick, but uh, that is too close. You know, that is too close. And minus 10 tech cost. And plus one diplo relations, noise. So now we go heavy on getting those techs because we are way behind in technology. But like minus 10 tech cost, it's pretty good. And we're just going to do uh, reconquest or uh, core return for my permanent claims in regards to England. Nothing else crazy. Where did colonialism spawn? Kent? Okay. Alright. No, no, it's fine. Oh, plus 11 with Castile. So, they need to be plus 25 by the end of the war. Hey, we got all in soon. And we can do leader cost minus 10, I think is what I like. Or no, advisor cost minus 10. Yeah, we'll do advisor cost minus 10. Great. Really? I can't get it all. How do I get the claims on that? Oh, I don't. I'm just supposed to get them. I can vassalize them. Oh, I can't vassalize them. So that'll take one more war. Jeez, expensive. The Pope excommunicated me? Like, I really can't have that. That's very strange. Okay, the money problems are starting to become much more apparent. Do foreign spy detection. Need that prestige high.
once we get this fort, I'll peace out England. Then, oh, this is going to be a long episode. Okay, can we get England out? I can't have them return cores. Well, that sucks. All right, I got permanent claims on Burgundy now. <laughs> yeah, so no inheritance. No inheritance. That's fine. And we transfer this to Desmond. And we give it to Desmond. So now they should be big enough to complete that mission. Of course, I have to, you know, get Normandy <laughs> squared away, which isn't going to happen for a while. Now, we could go after Denmark for the Norway thing, okay? They have, like, nothing. I'm, I'm a little worried about AE, but, again, we need to make sure Castile likes us. So, let's do it. Gonna have a coalition, but even if I take no action on this, it's fine. And if we call in Burgundy, that makes things pretty easy. I don't even know what the war goal is. Shietland. Shietland. Where's Shietland? Hjotland. Hjotland. Oh. Hjotland. Alright, we'll get him on up there, boys. Oh, the economy, fools. And the micro coalition. We are force beating, but this war is going to be a lot of annoyances like that. Or a lot of uh, just being annoyed, so. We're low on manpower, too. War is going to be rough, but if we can swat snipe Norway out of this, like, come on. That'd be so sweet. And I probably shouldn't spend the mill points because I am behind, dude. He's just going to... Well, no, we need to make this happen as quickly as possible. Um, because if we lose this, then we're not gonna going to be able to swipe Norway. So actually, we got to get moving. Where did my other fleet go? Oh, they're both transporting. Okay. <laughs> Got confused for a second. Sorry, gamers. Oh, big battle. Oh, captured four ships. Holy shit. We got a galley. We got heavies. Oh, my God. We're getting pretty big for our britches, you guys. Oh, they got an air, damn it. <laughs> I 
I'm sitting here like, ooh, oh, oh, another one? Another one? Protestants. I just don't have enough sailors. Okay, I need to slow it down. This is why I have problems, is because I'm speeding through and it's inefficient. Oh my god. Okay, well that's no good. Take the prestige. Helps with our morale and our legitimacy, I think. Yeah, they're tech eight. This will be twenty eight K. They're in the fort, but outnumbered and out teched. There. That'll get us up. So if I can beat that army, that's that would be pretty big. Okay, yeah, everybody everybody needs to go heal. I just don't have any sailors. We're overextending very much. They get sealed though. Okay. Let's push. Let's try to win this battle. Vive la France! Got 8,000 men on him. Come on, baby. It's looking good. Yeah! Let's actually pop another, just to be sure. How are we looking here? We still have ticking war score. 13,000 Burgundians coming in the rear. This is looking really good. If we get all three capitals and these other forts, we might be able to swipe Norway here. Obviously, we have to move quickly. Oh, God. Yeah. 
Yeah, break off and help Burgundy. Beautiful. Get there, Burgundy. Come on. Nice. Um, combat would be great. Oh, we got the capital as well. This is looking really good, you guys. I mean, the, the rebels there, not particularly good. Come on, trap. Oh, they got... They're so fast. Did you see how fast they were? Oh, my goodness. Seventy-eight percent to get French vassal. Oh, but Castile's gonna kill my rebels for me. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, gamer. See if we can what we can do to this fleet. My ships are already damaged. We got them. Captured four ships. Holy shit. Oh, come on. We need that. I need 50 reasons, and it just has to be before the Reformation stuff happens. Oh, man. We're so close. Oh, God. We're so close. Um, no, I, I, the money situation is really shitty right now. Like it, it's, it's really pretty bad. <laughs> Like, after this war, it's recovery for a while. Oh, shit. Naval battle. Oh, they're fucking clapping me. Yeah, just get into port. Seventy-eight, man. Just need a couple more forts. Oh, man. Here, we need to get this. I'm sorry, Castile. I loved you. I desperately need ah oh, 16 reasons It could be like one fort like this Norwegian fort could do it Oh my god are you kidding me
there's I need a breach. If there's a breach there, I oh fuck. Okay. I got I have to try to go for the breach. I don't want to fight. Just win it. Just win it. I just need to get a breach. I still need 10 reasons. There it is. They'll, they will transfer me Norway, right? Oh, I could almost get Sweden, dude. That's a thick coalition, but I think it's worth it. We're doing it. If that's the end of the game, it's fine. It was worth it. Look at this, France! It's 1504! Let's see what the coalition does. <laughs> oh god. No, I can't do that. I get minus one. I can't do that. Okay, we can ally the Pope. And that should be fine because we have Ottomans. Yeah, like. We should be fine. Oh my god. Navarre is such a waste of a slot. Sorry to any Navarrese in chat, but. Yeah, no one's in chat. This is a YouTube video, Cardo. So now we have to seriously chill for a while. Like we got rebels. Um, we have low manpower. We have very low sailors. Like I might debase manpower. Oh, that's so sick. We got Norway and Castile, dude. Look at this France. This is going so well. Income's worrisome, but at minus three, it's actually not that bad. I get rid of my loans and we're good. Okay. Oh, I lost some big ships. Right. Looks like I'll be breaking this session up into three episodes, guys. So if you've, you know, watched this far, thanks. Appreciate you. This is a hell of a session, so.
A lot going down today. Portugal supporting the independence of Desmond? Desmond, why? I have too many vassals? I mean, we can arrange your death, Portugal. That's fine by me, man. All right, yeah, this is actually a little dire, so we're going to debase again, get another 13,000 manpower into the stacks. Honestly, they just need to, to chill. This isn't horribly terrifying, but we are... We're pushing it. We're pushing it pretty far here. Granted, we've done a lot. We've grown a lot. I think this is 100% worth it, but... Um, but we are pushing it, so... I'm going to try to be a little cautious here. Get the extra manpower, Cardo. You need it. Okay, so Aragon could be a target soon. Well, strong air actually, or strong uh, claim, so no, they wouldn't be one. Um, we will definitely need to hit England again soon, but we have a truce. Um, Brittany, we have a truce, so we're truced up all around. Genoa's thick. Good job, Genoa. But, frankly, we've pushed it very, very hard to get this far. So we're going to need to do a lot of just relaxing <laughs> to make sure that we um, don't go too off, far off the rails here. So Brunswick's the emperor. So here we are. It's 1506. We have Ireland. We have more of Scotland. We have Norway vassalized and Castile in a personal union. This run is going to be wild. Um, we're just, we're very big. <laughs> we're doing very, very well. Wait, they're, they have us at minus 15. Wait, wait, wait. I was gonna end the episode there, but let me see here. At the month tick. Minus 23. Oh, they're rating us at minus 23. Austria is 262. So it's a 285 point spread. Oh. I see. But that is something we could go for. We could go for HRE very easily. Oh, the coalition dries up. We're super behind on ideas and technology. Um, which is obviously rough. But the fact that we've done this much, you know, even without getting the inheritance, is like. It's fantastic. Like, I can't. It's just incredible. So, you know, once we have the truce broken with England, 1513, we'll retake all these cores and try to get more of that land so we can get reconquer Normandy. Um, once we have that, we'll have finished um, 100 Years War, and then we'll, I think, have finished Strengthen the Old Alliance. Or no, we have to get Brittany done first. So... Got cleaning up to get down the mission tree, but once we get through here, um, we can get this. 25% naval morale. Like, that's incredible. Centralized France. Like, things are going well, guys. Things are going very well. So, thank you all for hanging out. We're finally going to end it there. <laughs> and um, we'll see you next time. So, this is a good run, guys. This is a good run. Nowhere to go but up from here. All right, hold on. This is like this is like the end of the Lord of the Rings movie. It's like, oh, we're going to end it. No, we're not. Oh, we are. No, we're not. Oh, we're not. We're going to end at the year, 1507.
The economy fools. Norway doesn't like us, but that's it. Castile's good. Everybody's good. Except for Desmond. Desmond, what's your deal, man? Age of Reformation. There you go. We just got Norway in time. I really don't... I don't... I need them. At least until my AE goes down, I really need Burgundy. <laughs> Because they would join. They'd flip right around and join that coalition. Alright, Norway likes us, so we can take that off. Just do it on automatic. Oh, I missed it again! I missed the January again, you guys. That's it! We're done! We're done! Thank you guys for hanging out. Thanks for watching for so long. Really appreciate your continued support. Check out the YouTube channel. You're already on the YouTube channel. Check out the Twitch channel. Watch us. Tuesdays. EU4. Tuesday nights. 9 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. EU4, baby. The big multiplayer game. Hope to see you there. Have a good night, y'all. Or day or whatever.